Police dispatch, how can I help you? Oh, is this the Culver City Police? Yes. So, I'm here at security, uh, security at platform. We have a guy here who opened some water sprinklers and he has a knife. What theaters were you at? Uh, platform. What's the address? Uh, 8850 Washington. Okay, so 8850 Washington Boulevard in the city of Culver yes. City? Yes, 8850. Where on the property is he? Where on the property is he, sir? So I'm on the on the parking garage on the sixth floor, the left there. Is he threatening anyone with it? No, he just like he would like close the door, leave me out, take care of it. Then we saw he has a knife. We backed up. Where was the knife? Knife. He's the one who opened it. Where did he Where did he lock himself in it? And on the on the some stairs in the back. And he just closed the door on us. Is it lock. like a stairwell? Yeah, a stairwell. Is it a homeless guy? He seems like it. He has like some, uh, yeah. He has the, uh, the, the fire extinguisher. That's what he's using. Mr. Van Lusen made his way to the top level of the six level parking structure and entered a stairwell. Once in the stairwell, Mr. Van Lusen ruptured a water pipe within the stairwell, caused a large amount of water to flood the stairwell and spill out onto the entrance of the top level of the parking structure. The Culver City Fire Department was also dispatched to the call regarding flooding and arrived on scene before our police officers. Stop A2 for item 2, David. 4-17 David. at the platform 8850 Washington, 8850 Washington Boulevard. There's a male subject with a knife in the parking structure on the sixth floor. He's not threatening anyone with it. 4 <laughs> item 2, David, copy. Who's our team? Wow. Oh, David, we'll handle from the station. You can clear to David. 10-4, 2-David, 10-22. 4-2-David, top. Thank you, sir. South Bay 2 for item 1, David. The RP has been employed in advising the subject as a transient that has locked himself in the stairwell. At the top floor, he's a male white, late 20s, wearing a black shirt and underwear. Got it. In South Bay 4 item 1, David, the fire department was out there for a commercial fire alarm, and they're requesting PD code 3 for the man with the knife. 4-2-David, we'll be responding from the station. 10-4. At approximately 2.32 p.m., Culver City police officers attempted to make contact with Mr. Van Lusen via the entrance to the stairwell on the top level of the structure, as well as from a lower level entrance to the stairwell. Here, please, we're we're out there. We're making, uh, attempting to make contact with the subject at the rooftop of the parking structure. So we're going to be in the uh, stairwell. Hey, just come out slowly. All we want to do is talk. We want to help you. It's uh, Samir's point of country. Hey, just come out slowly. We want to help it's you. To, uh, to pick a spot We're not here to hurt you. After several minutes, Mr. Van Lusen activated the fire alarm and briefly exited the door on the top level of the structure with a fire extinguisher in his hand. Moments later, Mr. Van Lusen re-entered the stairwell and closed the door. Uh, he advised, he's pulled the uh, fire alarm and he also has the fire extinguisher with him. He's going to uh, fire steam to the down below. Yeah. One of you is the primary guns. One of our department's mental health evaluation hey, officers arrived on scene and attempted What's to talk name, with Mr. Van Lusen through the stairwell. What's up? You got what? Yes, I do, sir. I don't know if you're doing I'm not crazy or anything. I haven't done anything yet. There were several other officers directly outside the stairwell door as well, one of which was armed with a 40 millimeter projectile launcher. This weapon shoots a foam projectile and is used as a less lethal force option. We have it. Yeah, firm, we see him. Uh, we're between the fourth and the fifth floor in the stairwell. And we got eyes on him holding the door. Is that something in his left hand? Got it. Drop it! Drop it. Yeah, I'm on the other side of that door. Drop what you have! Hey, At approximately 2.49 p.m., Mr. Van Lusen abruptly exited the entrance to the stairwell on the top level of the structure with a knife in one hand and a pipe in the other and charged at the officers. At this point, an officer-involved shooting occurred. Hey, watch out, knife! Two of our officers fired their handguns at Van Lusen, striking him multiple times. 
an additional officer fired a 40 millimeter launcher, which also struck Mr. Van Lusen. Hey, watch out, no! Shot fired, shot fired. Immediately after the shooting, the officers on scene rendered medical aid to Mr. Van Lusen until Culver City Fire Department personnel arrived on scene. Mr. Van Lusen was transported to a local hospital where he succumbed to his injuries.